Have you ever wondered why opioid addiction takes such a firm grip on some people's lives? It's a question that many of us have pondered as we witness the staggering scale of the opioid crisis. Opioids, a class of drugs that includes everything from prescription painkillers to illegal substances like heroin, are causing havoc on a global scale. But what makes opioids so addictive? The answer lies in our brains. Opioids tap into our brain's reward system, releasing a surge of dopamine, a neurotransmitter associated with feelings of pleasure and reward. This powerful rush can make the brain crave more, leading to a cycle of use and addiction. The statistics paint a grim picture. Millions are ensnared in the grip of opioid addiction, impacting individuals, families and communities. Yet it's not just an individual problem, it's a societal one that demands our collective attention and action. Understanding the depth of the opioid crisis is the first step towards addressing it. Now, imagine a life where you are constantly in the grasp of a substance, a life dictated by opioid addiction. This is not an existence anyone would willingly choose. Yet for many, it's a brutal reality. The physical toll of opioid addiction is severe, with risks of organ damage, overdose and even death. But the damage doesn't stop at the physical. Psychologically, addiction can lead to a vicious cycle of dependence and withdrawal, fostering mental health disorders like depression and anxiety. It's like being trapped in a whirlwind of despair, with no clear way out. Socially, the impacts can be equally devastating. Relationships can buckle under the strain, as trust erodes and withdrawal from loved ones becomes the norm. Employment can be jeopardised, leading to financial instability and homelessness. The ripple effects of opioid addiction are vast and far-reaching, touching every aspect of an individual's life. A life chained by opioid addiction is no life at all. What if there was a way to break free from opioids? Let's dive right into it. The journey to freedom from opioids is a path of self-discovery, healing and growth, and it's one that doesn't have to be walked alone. Evidence-based treatments are crucial in this journey. One such treatment is medication-assisted treatment, combining medications with counselling and behavioural therapies. This method plays a critical role in reducing cravings and withdrawal symptoms, making the recovery process more manageable. Behavioural therapies, on the other hand, address the psychological aspects of addiction. They help individuals change their attitudes and behaviours related to drug use, increase healthy life skills and persist with other forms of treatment. But let's not forget the power of peer support. It offers a unique perspective, shared experiences and the reassurance that one is not alone in their journey. A comprehensive approach to treatment addresses the whole person, not just the addiction. Freedom from opioid addiction is possible, and it begins with the right treatment. But wouldn't it be better to prevent opioid addiction in the first place? Prevention is indeed the most effective strategy against the opioid crisis, and it requires concerted effort from all quarters. For healthcare professionals, it begins with safe prescribing practices. This means limiting opioid prescriptions to the lowest effective dose and only when absolutely necessary. At the same time, we need to educate the public about the risks of opioid misuse. People must understand that taking someone else's prescription or using opioids for non-medical reasons can lead to addiction. Finally, policies can play a significant role in reducing the availability of opioids. This could include stricter regulation of pharmaceutical companies, better tracking of opioid prescriptions, and more funding for alternative pain management therapies. Remember, every step we take towards prevention can save a life from the clutches of opioid addiction. Preventing opioid addiction is a collective effort, but together we can make a difference.